Yes, we're celebrating Housing Week. And what a story there is to tell. Nearly a quarter of Singapore's population has been rehoused in these smart modern flats. And the 2,000 families. Lam Po 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 is in Doha. I don't know. Probably it's a big house. Block after block. Can you tell me about your sister? Where are they going? Lee Hong Zhen. Look at Ah Hui's house. Can you tell me about them? Do you know where Lam Po Po is in Doha? Where is it? The cafe is not like this. I know. Tell me about Lee Hong Zhen. 黄中山婆婆搬去边度Sir, I think I've come up with the perfect design for her. What about you? Hey, this is Taka Doloki. Hey! Don't worry. 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 Yes. What do you want? I came up with the perfect design for high-rise housing. You see, these buildings that we are living in are low-cost housing that the government had built very quickly, right? 20,000 units in two years because they are desperately trying to move people away from slums. So, I am quite sure they are not considering other stuff. Stuff that are more important than survival, you know? Because now we can. Okay, eating is the most important, right? So, now we are eating in this kitchen. Mm -hmm. hmm? But imagine. Now, the kitchens are facing one another. And I think, instead of kitchen windows, we should put doors in the kitchen. You open the door when you open the door, you can see a dark 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 dark. When you open the door, you can see the door and see the door. Now, you can open the door and see the door. You can open the door and see the door. Hmm... Because this is a dark 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 dark. I think I should go to the dark dark. Yes, we should go bigger and taller. It is uh, like a, a kampong, ah, but a high-rise kampong. That's the design. Yes. So? I don't think I'm tendering anymore. I'll still pay you the time you took to come up but with why? this. Uh, is it the design? I, I think I can change something. We don't have the technology in Singapore to build this. I don't know. Kampong? Building? Kui Tao Xiong Tao.
你觉得是对女生要寻找的时候，还是对你要寻找的时候？我觉得两个。我老的，挑你耶。Mr. Lim， 干嘛叫啊？哎、欸，你全班的水也晒过。你工人搬走咗未噶？哦，搬走了啦。但是嗬，你礼拜嗬都唔先你一搬嚟咧。诶，等下我哋家啲河南人过嚟喎，我打包我等佢好快食食。哦，好得意。哦，来呀啊！哦，哎，走走走走走。I have Mr. Tan, the architect of the building we meet tonight. Please don't treat this as your own house, okay? 你老公来啊？在呢。Mr. Tan. First of all, thank you for inviting me back to this place. It's been a while and very touching for me to see it in its present state. This was built very much earlier when Singapore first became independent. I think Dr. Lee would have seen those news back then. You must have been a child still. You guys really did a good job keeping your homes fairly nice. It would be nicer without all the renter and Airbnb. Sorry, 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 sorry. Hey, Freddy! Now what time already? Is there any joke to work? Some crisis at work. You're joking with me. Honestly, Mr. Tan, as the building gets older and older, and then the maintenance gets higher and higher, you know, up hall also cannot pay already. And we also don't know what to do. Also, it's hard to keep all the residents from selling since so many developers are willing to offer so much money. With that said, none of us here are intending to sell our units. Yeah, no, 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 we don't want to sell. Which is why we decided to call you up, Mr. Tan. Yeah, we don't know how to fix the pipe anymore. And the ceiling also cracking. Leh. Only today, my Allah oh, have to climb up the ladder to put the Unfortunately, plaster. Unfortunately, things happen with age. Uh, right, Dr. Lee? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm a Apo. How sang yan, go to a go si ke, so we low la. Okay. Yeah. I could submit something, but it's going to be much lower than what we discussed. Then you might as well don't submit at all. This is the first ever private tender in Singapore. You know very well the kind of prices that other developers will be bidding with. So you rather me not submit anything? There's so much to be built in Singapore right now. You don't have to worry this being your last assignment. So, this is a plan I have for you guys, what I would call a voluntary conservation plan. This piece of land is one per bank, and this is per bank apartment. The amount of units that we have on this plot of hill right now was decided by URA donkey years ago, what we call plot ratio. All of you residents collectively own this plot of land. Based on our unit size? Ah? That's right. 
based on your unit size. So if, if we can get URA to increase the plot ratio, which means allow us to build more on this piece of land, then I'm confident that I can create an addition like this or like this. We can then collectively sell this extension to people who are interested to join the community. Mm -hmm. With that money earned, minus the cost of the construction, we can then fund whatever maintenance it is that the building needs. The idea holds. The idea holds. The idea holds. Mm. And I think we might have enough to extend the lease for your unit back to a fresh 99 years. 99 years! It would be enough for all of you to grow old here. Even for some of the children to grow old in this place. Dear Mr. Chiu Hin Suan, in response to your Pearl Bank Apartments design proposal, we are pleased to Pleased to inform you that Hoxing Enterprise has been awarded the contract despite the low bid. You are expected to complete the construction of the design submitted by architect Mr. Tan Chen Shong, as this tender is awarded to you by Mary of Design. Mary of Design? Mr. Chiu! Mr. Chiu, are you really not going to sign the contract? I told you, I cannot afford to have a failed project. This is my first land developing gig. I've came a very long way as a supplier before reaching here. Then why do you bother to bid? Because I thought we wouldn't get it! Mr. Chiu, I know you are concerned about profits, but think about this. Every single cent that you are not saving is going into making someone's home better. This is the home that will become their shelter that Singaporeans will set up their families in. Find another developer that will help you realise your crazy dream. I have a family to feed. So what kind of home you want your family to live in? You keep talking about providing for your family, giving them a good life, and then? The good life you want your son to have is to be glued in front of the TV all day, is it? Mr. Chu, there must be a reason why the government is giving this project to us. And at this point of time, Ah, we got it! Oh. You already has granted us permission to increase the plot ratio. So many months of weekly meeting, Mr. Yeah. Tan. Your hard work has finally paid off. maintenance, Mrs. Lim. <laughs> Yes, we still need 100% of the residents to agree to put this plan to proceed. Who will say no? It's the speculators in this building. La. Smith is speculator. As with every condominium in Singapore, there are some people who own some unit to make some money. That's why there's so much rental and Airbnb. For them, they want to make the most money, right? They just want to sell the whole building uh, to a new developer. They are very aggressive. Pearl Bank has been put up for on block for so many times already. But they have failed. Yeah, but... As long as there's a speculator that's owning a unit in this building, you will never get 100%. Yes, I know it's not easy to... Or, the or maybe, speculators. maybe we should just strike what the iron is hot. You know, the developers are still interested in this piece of land, you know. And I've heard they may come back with a bid that is more than the previous failed on block bids. I heard one developer is willing to even go to, what, 700 million or something like that. 700 million? Mm. Hey, one or two million, at the very least. And Mr. Slim, your unit is bigger, so think of your kids, you know. Think of what they'll be able to do with that amount of money. 
They will not be bounded by anything anymore. Freddy, this building is national heritage. Of course you can talk about national heritage, Doctor. You have a few million dollars in your bank and you are old. None of this matters to you. Hey, your parents never leave behind this unit for you to sell, eh? Did Alex Po talk to you? Who is Alex Po? Chairman of the On Block Committee. Nakong. Where's boy? I call him Tampu Mai. Even if I agree to the conservation, as long as Alex Po owns one of the units here, you will never get 100%. We could go to land office to ask them to lower the percentage for conservation. We have done it with URA and we will do it again. But if they say no, we can still go up to Parliament. Huh? Parliament? My love. Are you confident with 90%? I think we can achieve 90%. I don't think I want to wait anymore. Freddy. This place we grew up together. The corridor, the staircase. We play together as kids. This is aku tengah ada banyak problem lah. Apa problem? Aku boleh tolong. Aku tak ada pilihan lain. So should we do a vote now? On block only needs eighty percent of owners to agree. And I think Alex Bo can convince them with this kind of pricing. Some of you might not agree with it, but you'll just be a part of the 20%. Where's everybody going to move to?